My name is uh, Usaini Abdu. I'm the country director of Plan uh, International in Nigeria. Uh, for us, Plan, uh, we are very committed um, to ensuring that 100 million girls around the world lead, learn, decide, and thrive. Of course, a girls experience different challenges in different contexts. Those in the northeast of the country, the kind of challenges they are facing is completely different from those who will possibly be in the other parts of the country. But the reality is that they are faced with difficult, difficult challenges, whether they are challenges that have to do with the patriarchal nature of our society, or that those that have to do with certain deniers that they experience by virtue of their gender. Parents not sending their girls to school because of their gender, girls being abused, violated, whether it is sexual and other related violations that they experience on a day-to-day -day basis, the different kinds of abuses, the denial of space and voice um, for girls. tana oye ma ka abayan kofa ko bayan labule wata rana sun shiga suna duddubawa akwai yan mata ne a gidan ko babu aka ce musu babu ira na dai sun shiga rasa amma mu ta fitar da ko na fitsarin da muka yi a cikin rataje ta zubar sai suka bi ta ina yan matanki sai baba na yace bari a tafi da mu ba sai suka kama shi a lokacin suka daddaure shi sai suka kashe shi da suka kashe shi shine sai mun muka fita cikin dare muka gudu a cikin daren sai suka shiga ranan juma a cikin madagali suka same mu sai suka tafi da ni da yaya ta in suka tafi da mu cikin wani jeje sun same mu ne wani gida ne babba suka ajiye mu a ciki idan suka zo sun mutun yake yadda da su sai su dinga dukan shi ko su dinga wahaltar da shi hakan nan a lokacin ya ta Allah ya mata rasuwa sai ni kadai na rage da yan matan wani waje wanda na san su da wanda ban san su ba hakan muna zama tare da su shine a lokacin ya suka aurar da ni ma wani har na zo ni na aifi yaro bare kuma su ba mu ji dai bane wancan zai zo wancan zai fita ko far gidan kuma ko wanda yake ga hadin mu a cikin kuma gidan ba wai mace dai ne mai aure haka ba a dukkan yan matan da suka aura a cikin gidan da su shigo su abinda za su yi da su su kama yan ya su fita tana ai fiyaru bare shine mu kai shawara da ni da yan mata wasu guda biyar muka cira mu fita mu dawo ranan an yi ruwa da daddare shine muka fita muna ta tafiya sai muka samu wani kauye muka je muka tsaya sai muka samu wata tsofuwa tana zaune tace daga ina muka ce mata mu fito ne daga wani waje suka ce to mu shiga gidan su mu koya daga riya waye sai tace da ta tura mu wajen sojoji shine aka kai mu wajen sojoji sai suka kawo mu cikin gwaza da suka kawo mu cikin gwaza sai na zo gida da suka zo ni gida na samu mama ta babu tara su na hadi ne da wani abu ba shi ne ya bani labarin cewar masu taimako kungiya plan international za su yi taimako akan irin hatsarin da na fada a cikin suna neman kalan mu yan mata shine yasa sanadin da zai sa zan koma makaranta kuma an samu aikin da zan nayi in taimaka kaina the level of child marriage in nigeria is appallingly unacceptable and we see that in different segments of the country and expressed in different in different forms it's a major issue in the north of the country it's a major issue in the east of the country it's a major issue in different parts of this country girls in some part of the country are not allowed to complete their education some don't even get enrolled in schools at all girls are denied certain accesses um, they don't have voice in different communities their voices are not treated uh, uh, very seriously they experience different forms of of discrimination my daddy did not value female education they wanted to send me and my other sister out on early marriage because of my daddy wanting to go and marry one old man at the age of 40 years. My daddy went to go and talk to the man to come and marry me because the man has money more than him.
my father less more value on the boys more than the girls. In this Akampa community, at least, it's only 30% that believe that there's a need to send their female children to school, while 70% believe that we have farm, we have bush, that they are female children. If you marry, they will, they will just give you a portion of land to farm and eat with your family. My father says that we women, we are, we are going to end up in the kitchen that we will not help the family. That will not be anything in the family that the female, that the male church, that they should go to school, that we should stay back and marry. Now they carry me and give to a man. So I'm now pregnant and give the one child. Do not even take good care of me. Beating, beating every day. So I now decided to run out. When Plan International came, we started attending one program for girls. When Bloom Plus was introduced by Plan International to Odupani LGA, we had some difficulty initially because uh, parents found it difficult to accept the, the program because the program came at the time to cut across their beliefs, the societal norms, and some peer pressure. Um, initially, we didn't have the number of beneficiaries we have now, but after the intervention of this program, we find out that parents on their own were bringing children to us, and we even have more children to enroll than before. My mother started paying school fee for me, but my dad did not pay the school fee for me. The reason me I stopped for is this one, because of marriage, because I kept pregnant for that class. I stopped going to school. That is why I know one might begin to stop and end for the place near the end. Here in our community, in our area, bright price of a female child is at least nothing less than 100,000. But 100,000, I don't see anything reasonable in 100,000. You will just finish it within, let's say, within one week or two weeks and a goat. But as a, a facilitator, I don't equate the value of 100,000 or a goat to the future of a female child. What plan I've done in this community, in all this our community, has inspired me to, to plan to go back to school. As this association, I need more girls to forward this education mm -hmm. for this our community. Now I am in SS3 ready for my final examination, thanks to Plan International. Shakara na gumo sha ku suka shiga gwada. Da suka shiga gwada kwanan su uku. Ya muka boye baban mu asali. Ya muka boye baban mu asali sai suka zo suka ce suna nan maza gida gida. Sai muka ce musu ba sa nan suka sunna in ba sa nan tunda akwai sulin a gidan bar mu gode harbawa in ba mutum sai za mu tafi da suka harba sai baban mu ya fado daga sama sai suka ce ya kai yanka suka zo kwana ku da hagan binda baban mu sai suka ce za su tafi da ni sun ja mamu a a ba zai tafi da ita ba za tafi da ita a ba zai tafi da ni ba to daga nan sai muka juya sai suka ce a wallahi tafi da ni ya zama a kai ni kofan sarki in Amir na su ya ce banka aure ba sai ba za su aure ni ba to daga nan sai muka tafi da muka tafi Amir na su har na wuce aure ma yace sai muka tafi suka aure ni sai suka ce tunda an tun nayi garrama ma bazan zo na garna ba sai suka yi ni kauyen garin su muka tafi da su shekara na 1 da wata 2 a can muna zama to muka musu nika za mu dafa musu abinci su ci to sai aka sai muka ci to bari mu fita muna kan fita suka kawo mu da suka kawo mu suka ci mu inan bulale ya kama mu amma ba sa kashe mata amma bulale ya kama mu aka mana duka har cikin ya samu masala ya zube nika mu har baya ma akwai tabo ga shi har kafa na akwai tabo da na zo gwada daga gurin su ina zama ina zama a gurin su suka ci to yanzu mu aure za kara miki mijin ki aje yaki ga shi bai da ba ga shi kin fito kara miki mutana uku a gurin su daga nan akwai su mata ya su ma suna san fa suka ci mu fita tama da gali muka fita tama da gali muka zo in kuwa tama da gali ina zama a kuwa inar mamata muna zama a gurin ta muna zama a gurin ta sai boko haram suka ce sai suka ce ni ina mana wuce aure ko an bar ni sai aka ce a an mun aure miji na in ya tafi aiki ne shi yasa sai a tun da tafi aiki ai bai dawo ba tun da bai dawo ba za mu dora miki aure suna gobe za dora mu aure sai suka shiga da dare ma da gali muka suka fita da mu suka kawo mu gomin college muna zama a gomin college duk wanda ya fita ya ce yana so na shi a wannan wannan ta yi tayi rayuwa da boko haram in ka aure ta su ka shiga sanadin plan international sai mu ko fara yaki da jahilci kuma zan koma makaranta 
We are committed to ensuring that 100 million girls around the world lead, learn, decide, and thrive. And Nigeria, being the biggest country in, Af in Africa, will have to contribute enormously to that size of the 100 million that we are actually trying to affect.